Five women who work as engineers were considered for the coveted Young Woman Engineer of the Year Award. They work in such diverse fields as power, traffic control, explosion safety, telecommunications and toy development. A former winner on the judging panel says it had a profound impact on her career. Winning the prize just changed my life completely. Um, I actually spent 12 months going around different events, schools, colleges, but it also gave me a different slant on how I looked at engineering and how I was perceived in work as well, a lot more professionally. Engineering offers a wide range of opportunities in many fields and is a dynamic and stimulating career choice. With so few women taking up the challenge, it's events like this that are used to encourage them to consider an engineering career. There's a, a north lot of opportunities. The thing is we're not getting enough candidates coming through to actually take up engineering degrees and then pursue a career in engineering. Um, an engineering degree gives you such a, an opportunity for all sorts of jobs and we particularly want women not to go into the city but to come into engineering to support British industry. The runner-up was Mumta Singhal, who worked on toy development and is currently teaching budding new engineers at Strathclyde University in Scotland. Engineering for me is really creating the future. It's, it's coming up with new fascinating ideas and applying technology and, and creative ideas to everyday thinking. So for me, engineering is, is my life and blood. It's brilliant. This year's winner was Alice Della Hunty, who works for power generator E.ON. She believes it offers scope to work on finding green solutions to create power. A huge amount of my work is research and development into low carbon technologies, especially in the field of how we use electricity, uh, which is something we haven't focused on in the past. It's been very much how we generate electricity. So, um, yeah, I mean, the idea of being able to work in a real blue chip company, do a great job and save the planet, um, it's just so exciting. I mean, that's what I love about it. There's about 30 engineers in that group, and we look at everything from generation to distribution right down to how people use their energy. She also feels engineering offers women a diverse range of leading career opportunities that will shape the world of tomorrow. There's a huge shortage of engineers so it means you know you can be very picky about what job you do, you can do the best jobs out there. Um, engineers work on so much, you know, it's engineers that design iPods, it's, it's engineers that set up the systems we use every day, it's engineers that work on power stations and, and do things about climate change. So there's so much to choose from and there's so much that's so new and so exciting. And Technology is so advanced these days and it's just getting further and further. There's really, you know, there's no limit to what you can do and I think that's what's so exciting about it is, is just working on stuff that changes the world, it changes people's lives. This is the 30th Young Woman Engineer of the Year Award and with today's ever-changing technological world, it's hoped more women will take up engineering as a career choice. One and a half and two. Good.